Good morning. We are going to be doing the crocodile stitch again. Uh, we'll be chaining three and placing a DC stitch inside that same spot. We are going to chain one and place one DC two one DC in that V stitch. <laughs> We're going to chain again and place. 2DC inside the 1DC from the previous row. That's one. We're going to place another one. There we go. That's our second one. And we are going to chain one again and place... Oh, yeah. Chain one. There we go. And place 1DC inside the V from the previous row. Next stitch, we're going to chain one and place 2DC at the end there. I have a lot of tails sticking out, so we're going to be sticking, we're going to be um, tucking those in as we go. <sighs> All right, so here I'm going to be chaining one. You don't have to chain one. Um, it works without the chain one, but I'm just going to chain one here. Having some difficulties. All right, so now we're gonna five double crochet on that what that first DC post. So that's one. Yeah, keep going. Two. There's three. Four. And five. <laughs> and now we're going to go around from the bottom over underneath into the other um, post and do another 5DC. So we're going around in like a circle up back up to the top. How many is this so far? I can't see in the video. <laughs> I think that's it yeah that was five of them and then we're gonna single crochet in that 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 DC post from the last row <laughs> and then we're gonna do another five and I'm just gonna speed it up right here because this was the last video And here we are, just finishing up there. We're slowing down to do 5DC in this last V chain. On one side, we're doing five. And then on the last on the last side of this last scale, we're gonna be doing another 5DC. Here we go. Oh, I lost my stitch there. rotate now yeah there we go one now on the other side one two three four and five and this is how you do a crocodile stitch for the second row Yarn over and archive with me next time. Thanks.